Hey guys, Sam here from Eating Clean, Cooking Dirty, and we are on to the wear of meal prep. This is a really short one today, just want to warn you. So, two things I want to talk about, grocery shopping and kitchens. So, the grocery shopping, you got to get your grocery shopping done. You can do that in big box stores, in uh, regular grocery stores, Costco, Ralph's, Albertsons, Whole Foods, New Seasons, Roast Hours, um... There's so many places. And then now you can do Amazon. So Amazon will deliver your groceries for you. Um, that is an awesome option. If you really don't have time to do it, you can have them do it for you. So they will deliver. You can schedule deliver from your local grocery store, which is fantastic. So um, I also want to tell you about buying um, from the stocked pantry. So I provide a stocked grocery list for, for my uh, clients and my email list members. It's, a, it's totally free. Anybody can get it. And what it is, is if you are going to go paleo gluten-free, it is a grocery list of stocked items that you should go out and potentially buy to have in your kitchen ready to go. And that includes things that are going to last a long time, like canned tomatoes and broth if you don't make your own and olive oil and coconut oil and different some different spices, some salt, pepper, that kind of stuff. So I really, really suggest that. Do the grocery shopping. Bulk grocery shopping is the key to saving money when in the grocery shopping realm, right? Um, I love bulk sections. Even if you have to go to Whole Foods because it's the only place near you that has a bulk section, you are going to save more money by shopping just the bulk section at Whole Foods than you will going to a big box store and buying, you know, if you need paprika for a recipe and you don't usually use it, you don't want to spend $6 on a can of paprika or even four dollars you want to spend 15 cents on a tablespoon right or even less than that that is the key it makes a really big difference also bulk nuts you can save a lot of money um last thing the kitchen that's where meal prep happens so when you do when you're getting ready to meal prep clean out your refrigerator clean out your clean your kitchen once a week get ready for meal prep so that once you bring your food into the house Everything is ready to go. Your kitchen is your ki kitchen is clean. Your refrigerator is cleaned out. You've got all your tools, and you know where you're going. Okay, so that's the where do you meal prep? Good grocery store, bulk buying, clean kitchen, ready to go. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.